guys doing? And welcome back to the Song and Files with me, your girl, No Fuses. Uh, last time we go and beat up some thugs. We talked to Mama for some info, and now we're about to see what we get. We can get out of the Yakuza. So let's get into it. And if you guys want to see more videos of the game, then please don't hesitate to destroy that like and subscribe button. Let's dive on in. The music gets me every time I hear it. The crest. The Kumakura crest. Alright, let's talk to Mr. Smiles over here. About Shoko. Let's start with that. I don't know nothing about her. Of course you don't. I know her face and her name. It was on the news. Nothing else. I have no idea what you're talking about, cop. You must have gotten some bad info. <laughs> what? The chairman is right in front of you. What? I run the Kumakura gang. I'm Moma Kumakura. What? Damn. That can't be right. The chairman of the Kumakuras is Rohan. You aren't the chairman. Yo, asshole. You need a lesson in manners? Date, wait. I did some research and discovered that Rohan Kumakura died last year. Oh, he so he's the new head. A suicide. But MoMA did not take over last year. MoMA took over six years ago. So, the old boss retired a long time ago. Six years ago. Hmm. Hmm, it seems that the case from six years ago is, uh, making an appearance, huh? The thing that we needed to know before all this shit went down that the boss refuses to tell us? Hmm, we might need to look into that file. Fuck no. Why would we do that? Dante, look at this. A thermograph from when you inquired about Shoko. Body temperature rising. Red hot lie. Ooh. It appears that way. How do I get him to come to it? Remove his fingernails one by one. Oh my god. <laughs> she about that life. Not my style. Blackmail him? Blackmail? Find his weakness and threaten him with it. Let's examine the room. Perhaps we may discover one of his secrets. I mean, this dragon looks pretty suspicious. If I make a wish, will if it I make come a true? That is not Shenron. <laughs> I wish for panties. Oh my god. You know you can buy them at the store, guy. You can just say that they're for your wife or girlfriend or something. I told you that's not Shenron. Salty because we beat your ass. The fat one, he's holding his stomach in pain. And he's unconscious. There would be no point in talking to him in that state. Locker, locker. Door maybe? The door's in the next room. Oh, it's not important. Maybe there's something on him personally. Keyboard? 
A keyboard. Nope, nothing. Computer? Lila, can you hack it? I cannot. The power is off. It's a personal computer. I have a can hack it. It's turned off. A Shinto shrine. There ain't nothing special there. There are lanterns with the Kumkura written on them. Ooh. Oh, he's a fan. Ha ha ha. Ha 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 ha. There's a hidden safe behind the crest. There is something inside. I recognize that. It's just like the one I saw at Matsushita Diner. An Aset figure. Correct. But why is that there? Unknown. But perhaps. Hey. You wouldn't happen to be a fan of Aset, would you? What? Who's that? A schoolgirl internet idol. You know what I'm talking about. Think you can get away with talking to our boss like that? She's tough as bricks and hard as nails. Never be into pussy shit like that. Fucker. Ah, okay. So he keeps in the safe so his employees doesn't find out he likes girly stuff. Okay. Fears? Fears. Upset? Regret? Hasten! Oh, God. Water. Wait! Sweat, he said, he said you back. Shadows, threat, a silhouette, he said. Just as I thought. Boss, what's this? Sh shut up! Don't look at me. Get out of here. Yeah. <laughs> yep, a true fan. Yep. He's looking at him like, okay. Did you hear me? I said, get the fuck out of here. Yes, sir. The fat one grabbed the skinny one and dragged him out. I've got your secret now. If you don't want that to get out, you better answer my questions. Yeah, yeah, I got it. How did you know? You're hiding an ASET figure in the safe. How did you know that? I have superpowers. Yeah, sure. <laughs> he kind of actually does. I mean, if you want, if you think about it. Rohan was my older brother. Really, he looks like he could be your father. He was my big brother in this organization and my blood brother. But he's gone now. A suicide. Yeah, after breaking out of the hospital. Right. We do have connections with the investment company Shoko worked at. A company that commits fraud. No comment. Anyway, we never had any problems with Shoko. There'd be no reason for us to kill her. About 20 years back, both he and I were the new guys in the Ujisaki family. The Ujisakis are above the Kumakuras in the hierarchy. At the time, we were in a turf war with a rival gang. One day, one of their boys walks in here and beats my bro's face in with a metal bat. His vision's been fucked on the right side ever since. The doctors say he can still see, but it doesn't register. Like, he only eats food off the left side of his plate. And if he's drawing a picture or whatever, he only draws the left side. Date, a question for Moma. Is Rohan left-handed? Why? Just ask him, please. Why does that matter? Yeah, he was. Confirmed. Rohan must suffer from hemispatial neglect on his right side. As you are aware, the brain is divided into what is called the right brain and left brain. Right. One side develops into the superior hemisphere, responsible for language and higher functions. The other side controls spatial recognition ability. In most people, 
the superior hemisphere is the left brain. In roughly one third of the population, the right brain is the superior hemisphere. This is often linked to left-handedness. MoMA just confirmed that Rohan was left-handed. From this, we can conclude that his right brain was his superior hemisphere, and his left brain was the inferior hemisphere. Rohan suffered a beating on the left side of his head. That must have damaged his left brain. That caused him to lose his spatial cognitive ability. No point hiding it, right? Yeah, I know about Shoko's ex. I told Mom about Renju's accident and about his disappearance from the Do hospital. Do you know where he is? Nope, sure don't. It's not like we keep in touch or anything. I detect no abnormalities in his thermograph. Looks like he's not lying. Anyway, after getting the shit beaten out of him, he changed, man. He became cold-blooded. I'm talking ruthless. One time, we captured some street bosses from a rival gang. Bro grabbed him by the big toe and took a potato peeler to him. From the toe to the thigh. Ow! Totally blank expression. Like he was scraping bonito flakes. Anyway. Sick fuckers like that always end up running the world, don't they? He started climbing the ranks, and eventually, he was taken in by the Ujisaki family boss. The Ujisakis decided to make him head of our gang, and that's how we became the Kumakuras. Hey, Moma, I've got a favor to ask. Can you get me information on Renju? His whereabouts, rumors on where he might be, anything. I need some leads. And what if I refuse? Then your gang finds out you're the world's biggest ASAP fan. <sighs> yeah, you forgot about the little this detail? In exchange for helping me, there's a reward in it for you. A reward? I'll let you meet ASAP. What? I met her yesterday at Lemniscate. We're acquaintances now. Really? Yeah. You promise? Yeah, I promise. <laughs> He's like, you promise, please! About six years ago, I remember him telling me about something big. Some threat to the Kumakuras that could bring us all down. He didn't give me the details, but... I figured it was something from his past coming back to bite him in the ass, you know? Anyway... His plan was to handle his shit internally. Didn't want too many people knowing about it. But whatever he planned didn't work. When the chips were down, he decided to handle it himself. He ended up shooting some guy in his house. A few days later, cops busted him. Prosecution tried to get him on premeditated murder, but it was determined that he was insane at the time. Maybe they were right, you know. His head's been getting worse and worse for the past 20 years. It's relapses and all that. Anyway, they decided to keep him in a special hospital. And naturally, because I'm his brother and next in line, I was the successor. Us Kumakuras are a branch of the Ujisaki family. The Ujisaki family runs a yearly golf tournament. Mandatory attendance. We were all at the tournament those days. We only got back this morning. You can ask the hotel. They'll tell you. Date, I did some research. The hotel's record of guests does list the Kumakura members. They were also seen on several surveillance cameras. It is not possible that any of the Kumakuras could have killed Shoko, including Moma. Hmm. The Kumakuras appear to be unrelated to the investigation. It was still worth it just to find out Moma is an ASAP fan. It was his face. That information might come in handy later. Let's go somewhere else, Iva. Yeah, because now every time we go for info, we can just say, ASAP. We got what we need. Where are we going? Oh, back to Abyss. Abyss.
What? Why are you in my car? Like this? I'm already tired of this, Iba. That's not like you. Is something wrong? Shogo's estimated TOD was two days ago, 5 p.m. It's been more than 48 hours, but our investigation has made zero progress. I'm sorry. I just wanted to whine about it for a bit. In five years, this is the first time I've heard you so dejected. Where could Renju be? I also wonder where he could have gone. I still cannot contact her. Her phone is either off or out of range of cellular signal. Are you worried about her? I mean, yesterday there was definitely something wrong. I saw it in Mizuki's Somnium. Iris's body. Frozen solid. Let's just toss her all the way. Six years ago, I lost my past. Names, addresses, family, childhood, everything. But that wasn't all I lost. My left eye. I don't know how I lost it. The earliest memory that I have is me aimlessly wandering the streets of Shiguku. Until a good friend gave me a hand. Come with me. To where you belong. Boss helped me become a cop and assigned me to Abyss. A year later, I was called into the control room where Pewter showed me something extraordinary. The official title is AI Ball. You may call her Iva. The artificial intelligence contained within this sphere is nothing sh an autonomous artificial intelligence. I mean, we, we already know about all of this. Its ability to We've already had this flashback. Special Agent Date, she will be your... We already knew about it. We already seen this flashback. It's been five years since then. Five years and a number of tough cases, but... This time is different. G -g Ghost! I have been here for several minutes now. Exactly. Did you not come out like that? Why not? If people see you, they'll freak out. E only you can see her. Do not worry. I can only be seen by you. I am sending this projection of myself directly to your brain. Oh. Right. But returning to your answer, why would people freak out if they saw me? Isn't it obvious? A girl looking like you, dressed like that, sitting next to me? People would think I'm a pervert. Hmm. Huh. Her face is like, I'm insulted. I have worked very hard on this design. If you continue saying such things, I will self-destruct. An AI never lies. So, you weren't kidding. What happens if you self-destruct in my eye socket? Your skull would pop like a balloon. My body is full of cutting-edge technology and state secrets. In terms of hardware as well as software, I am capable of hacking 99.99% of computers that currently exist. What if someone managed to steal me? It would threaten not only the police force, but the existence of the state itself. My self-destruct function is designed to prevent such a scenario from ever occurring. Strictly speaking, I am not capable of self-destructing. What do you mean? I obey the three laws of robotics as laid down by Isaac Asimov. The three laws of robotics? Are we going off the Will Smith movie, what is it, Robots or something like that? Oh my god. I cannot so many references. Myself. However, a person with administrative authority could order me to self-destruct. You have such authority. How many times are we going to keep talking about this? Let us determine a code note, one that will activate the detonator. Command 41205. If you issue this command, I will detonate. No, that's still too dangerous. 
Oh no, the fact that we're even talking about this means it's probably gonna happen in the game. This is a big red flag. Iva, I do not want you to go. We need some kind of safety. The number will be the first lock. If I give you the second command within one minute of the first... What is the second command? Let's see. How about if I tell a lie? A lie? Something that's not the truth. If I say something untrue, I want you to regard it as the second command. Understood. Okay. So if he says a lie, like, within a minute of putting in the code, um, she'll, she'll like, stop the self-destruct. And one more thing. Even if I die, do not worry. I will not be gone. Huh? Everything that I see and hear is uploaded to the cloud. All by wireless communication in real time. Even if my body is destroyed, my backup data will not be lost. Well, that's reassuring. Because I was really thinking, like, oh no, I put... My memories, as well as my core programming, will be preserved. So you're basically immortal. Yes. As long as the server is alive. About Shoko Nadami's murder, we still need to see the investigation through. The only relevant lead is the call made to Shoko's phone. Aiba, is that number still turned off? Please wait. Date, the line is connected. Really? Really. Call it. Is it your and don't say anything blocked? stupid. Try from a different line. You can do that, right? I can. Which line would you like to use? Does it matter? Um, say you're for the cabaret club. Uh, Shoko's phone. I see. The caller did attempt to call Shoko's phone. If we call from that line... Right, he might pick up. But a normal call may yield the same results as before. I have an idea. Do you remember what Shoko's voice sounded like? Yes, I do. I remember everything that I see and hear. Can you reproduce her voice? Analyzing recorded audio data. Imitation should be possible. Well then? But when they watched the news, it would have been like, wait a minute, how are you still alive? You want me to call with Shoko's voice? Yeah. Me? You're the only one who can. Fine. I suppose we have no choice. Are you sure you can handle this? I am an artificial intelligence. Not a human prone to nervous breakdowns and mistakes like you. Alright, Hal, let's see what you can do. It, it's connected! It's ringing! Really? You're looking pretty you nervous. You did get nervous. Down, deep breaths. <sighs> Wait a minute. What? I'm an AI. I don't take breaths. Exactly. Focus, they're gonna hang up. Um, hello. This is Nadami Shoko. Impossible. Shoko is dead. Yes, I died two days ago. Idiot, why did you say that? Oh, by I, I meant my twin sister, Shoku. Your twin sister? His name, get his name! How? How can we get their name? Accuse him of being an imposter, ask him, are you Yamadai? Ask him for his name, tell him I have a package and need his address. How about that? That sounds like the best way. Uh, uh, my sister has a package for you. Where should I deliver it? Just send it to my office. Where is your office? What do you mean? Look it up. Do you even know who I am? This isn't working. They're going to hang up. Damn.
let's just go with this. Is this Yamada? No. This is... Say it, say it. Are you sure you have the right number? It can't be. How did you get Shoko's? No good. Quick, think of another plan! I guess we're just gonna go the aggressive route. Let's just see how this goes. You're an imposter. I beg your pardon? Don't act dumb. You sound completely different. How did you get that phone? This is my... Liar! You're impersonating him. That's enough. I am so Sejima. Aha! There we go. The congressman. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Politician? Sejima. What was with that music you just played? Sorry for doubting you. It's fine. What were you calling me for? Oh, uh, sorry, something urgent just came up. I will call back later. Goodbye. Why so? Unknown. But that was definitely so Sejima. I was able to match his voice to public records of him speaking. So Sujima is a minor celebrity. He even goes on TV sometimes. Two days ago, he called Shoko. Why? In Good question! Case, that was an excellent performance, was it not? Yeah, good job. Is that all? What, yes. you want me to pat you on the head? N no nNothing like that! I tap my finger against my left <laughs> eye. Stop! It tickles! Rub, rub, rub! Stop! The nerve might break! I call came in soon after. Tate! A call from Investigation HQ. Connect me. Is this Special Agent Dante from Abyss? My name is Akaska from HQ. I'm investigating the Shoko Nadami case. If or you better not be about to tell me to get off the case. It's something that you need to hear. What is it? We got a phone call earlier from a prisoner at Fuchu Prison. A prisoner? We saved the call. I think you should give it a listen. Why is he sound like he's angry at me? Like I did something wrong. Ugh. Who is this? In here. I'm known as number 89. What is this call concerning? I know who killed Shogunadami. And if you what? let me out of here, I will tell you who it is. I suppose you might say I'm looking for a plea bargain. He will kill again, you know. And he'll take their eye while they're still alive. There will be more bodies. If you want to stop this serial killer, I suggest you take my offer. I'll be seeing you. Oh, so I'm pretty sure. This has to be a prank. That's what I thought too, but I felt I should give you the heads up anyway. Good idea. Thanks, Detective. Good luck. Do you think it really is just a prank? Well, to be sure, look into number 89. Roger that. But for now... So, Sejima. Oh, we're going straight to his house. You cannot escape. But shouldn't we go to Iris's house? Since no one's heard from the girl hey, since you can't yesterday be here night? Without permission. I'll call the police. <laughs> I am the police, bitches. What happened? Sir. A uh, police officer. You. Do we know you? Can I help you? I need to ask you a few questions. I'm a very busy man. You can ask me tomorrow during normal business hours. It's about Shoko Nadami. You can't tell me you've never heard of her. As a matter of fact, I have. It was reported on the news that she was killed. Two days ago at 9.02 p.m., you made a phone call to Shoko Nadami. 
I like how they all moved in sync just now. A phone call. I don't know what you're talking about. Yes, you do. Oh, what? All right, this is new. Ooh, you got real bright for a second. So much blood. Where's all this red coming from? It's a thermograph. Yeah. Yeah, I knew that. I mean, she already explained it to us. How can you already, like, not know what it was? Anyway, he's lying. How do I get him to admit it? Call him. Yep, yeah, that's probably the best. Call Lima, him. Call his phone again. Using Shoko's line. Understood. You're not gonna pick it up? It's from Shoko. I had her give you a call. What? It'll stop ringing soon. Three, two, one. See? Fine. I did call her. Around nine o'clock, just like you said. Finally confessing? There's nothing to confess. I did nothing wrong. Then why did you lie to me? Because I didn't want to get involved in all of this nonsense. You mean to tell me that I am a suspect? No, I I, I don't think he's a suspect. It's a su it's, he's very sus because he's hiding shit, but obviously the person who called at that time couldn't have been the killer because then they would have been like, oh, you're probably dead by now, so why the hell would they call you? My call was after Shoko died. If I were the killer, why would I do that? I don't know. But I'm asking the questions. Do you have a warrant? I thought not. I'll be leaving now. Good night, detective. So, when back inside his mansion, I tried to follow those bloggers block my path. Go home. Unless you want to get kicked out. Oh, do we really just go? I mean... Obviously, I'm still here, and it's not giving me the option to leave, so there's something else here. I don't know. Even if I did, it would be confidential. Do you know where So was Friday at 5 p.m.? Here, in the mansion. Can anyone corroborate that? Maybe the housekeeper. I don't know what you're talking about. I've heard of her, but I've never met her. I saw her on the news. No, nothing special. Not any different from any other politician, anyway. Date, a minute. What happened? So is on the move. Most likely in a car. Uh-oh, he's, he's running off somewhere. How do you know? I hacked So's smartphone and I'm currently tracking the GPS, not his rental phone, the one registered under his name. Where is he headed? Unknown. Somewhere to the east. Keep tracking him. Roger that. Yeah, it's time to go. Time to follow him. Where are you going? He's like, yeah, sprint. Yeah, so what's in the warehouse you were checking up on? What was So doing here? Date, my apologies. What's wrong? My battery is low. Are you serious? I guess it's not going to be a problem. I can still see out of my right eye. My vision half and I went into the warehouse. Is it really going to like cut the screen in half? That would be actually kind of cool.
Oh my god, his other eye is like pale. <gasps> oh no, it's freezing in here. No, 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 <laughs> no. If please tell me what I'm thinking is about to happen is happening. I swear I will lose my shit. The one thing that's super suspicious is this white cloth. Something covered with white cloth is on this the table. Is... Uh, it can't be. <gasps> no! 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 Iris! No! Iris. I knew it! The moment I, he stepped into the cold room, I knew it. I was like, please, let it not be who I think it is. And it was a prophecy. He did see a glimpse of the future. And he took her eye, too. Iba, what's your charge? Currently at 2%. Can you make a call? I can. I am connected to the power supply. What do you... Hurry. Just connect me to boss. Date, what's wrong? I found a body. What? She was murdered. Multiple stab wounds to the back. And one eye missing. Oh no. Location is Okiura Fishery Cold Storage Warehouse. The victim... The victim is Iris Sagan. Iris? I'll tell you more later. Just send CSI to the scene right away. And one more thing. Congressman So Sejima. Bring him to Abyss. Oh yeah, because he literally went in there to go and check up on it. So you obviously know something. Why? I'll take responsibility for everything. Just do it, please. <sighs> All right. Poor girl. And she knew she was gonna die, too. Like, she already knew. She's like, I don't got long to live, like. Because sometime real soon, I'm going to die. God damn it! Yeah, my first impulse was like, why didn't you visit Iris first? Like, that should have been, like, the first thing you've done. Like, it, oh my god. They're just kind of like, why aren't we visiting Iris? Especially after, like, that very sus stream that she went through. Like, come on. And now he feels super bad. Do you honestly think you can get away with this? Funny, I was going to ask you the same thing. Date, calm down. You know Iris Sagan, don't you? No, I don't. I've never heard of her. Maybe he's lying. Maybe he's not. But even if he doesn't know her name... Okay, we got clues. Okay. Um, there's a time of death where Iris is found. Okay. Let's show him that, because he also just came out of there. Iris's body oh. was discovered at Oki. Oki, you're up there. That caught my eye, too. But we'll get to that later. The actual press murder the wrong is unknown. The lack of blood at the scene makes it highly likely that she was killed somewhere else. So she was just there for storage. Probably to be displayed later. The information isn't relevant? Okay. No, it's not that. Even though he so doesn't know Iris. It's not these two, so how about that maybe? I put a picture of Iris in front of So. So you've never met her before? I have not. Have you seen her corpse? Corpse? I know you've seen her body. Based on what? That you came out the freaking fishery? 
that's also important, but there's something else. Iris's body was found at Okiura Fishery Cold Storage Warehouse. What does that have to do with anything? I stood up and went to the corner of the room, picked up the PC monitor and put it on the desk in front of him. This. Iba, play the video. Right away. I see. Then I suppose you know I was there. Then you saw the body. I didn't. I was at the warehouse, but I didn't see any corpses there. Don't lie to me! It's the truth. Then what were you doing there? I choose to remain silent. You what? Remain silent. I mean, it is his right to remain silent, but he, he was obviously doing something that he had to actually be silent for, so... That is my right, guaranteed by law. <sighs> Remember that I am a politician. He's like, I know all the rules and laws. I know my rights. Date, can I get a second? What? Does it matter if he saw the body or not in this case? He's a busy man. If we hold him here too long... You want me to stop beating around the bush? I certainly do. <laughs> She's like, let's go. Let's get it. <laughs> I believe that Sosajima is her killer. Or is at the very least involved in the crime somehow. Yeah, I think he was just involved in the crime. I think he's just covering up for somebody. Like, he knows who it could be, but he's like being tight lipped about it for some reason. Yeah. Why not ask him for his alibi first? Um, leaving the winner. Pitch, we already showed these two, so maybe this? Nah, not. Okay, maybe that. Iris was killed sometime between 2 and 3 in the morning. Do you have an alibi for that time? I was playing Mahjong all night at a place called Dora Dora in Shinjuku. Politicians spending all night in a Mahjong parlor. An exclusive Mahjong parlor. Yes. It's Mahjong. You should have had three opponents with you. Indeed I did, but they were all strangers. I don't remember their names. Date, I did some research. Dora Dora is a private room Mahjong parlor. It is owned and operated by one individual. If the rooms are private, that limits the number of potential witnesses. The shopkeeper might be in So's pocket, and he's the only one we can ask about So's alibi. Especially if he doesn't remember any of the three people he played against. He might as well not have an alibi. That's not much of an alibi, so... Please, this is ridiculous. First you suspect me in the matter of Shoko Nadami, and now this? I haven't killed anyone. Not Shoko, not Iris. Besides, if I stabbed a woman, why would I bring her to a cold storage warehouse? Wait. What did you say? Ooh, you don't fucked up! So didn't respond. But I remember, he slipped up. If I stabbed a woman, yeah, that means you looked at the fucking corpse. Mm-hmm. Which means you knew it was there. Because. I never mentioned Iris's cause of death. How do you know she was stabbed? Because. Because you did it? Don't be stupid. Then how do you know? Stop dodging the question and answer. Boss, give me permission to sink. He can't hide inside his own head. You've got it. Sink with him. And they're just like, he's like, we need to make progress and you're not giving us answers. We're gonna stuff ourselves in your head. Fuck it. time let us begin because there's a reason he's not talking so he might know who it is he's just like nope
Oh man. Oh my god. He going crazy with that forklift. Did you witness my superior driving technique? That's what you want to call it. Yeah, I saw you get in an accident. No! I only pressed the wrong pedal. That's what you call an accident. <laughs> oh, look at that. Don't change the subject. Observe the surroundings. Huh, in a word I'd say it's strange. Maybe this is So's corrupt nature manifesting itself. The man's Somnium is almost as corrupt as he is. I am impressed. Uh, never mind. Yeah, this is a real bad dream. Let's get the clues we need and get the hell out of here. <gasps> Iris! It's Iris! What on earth is she doing here? Uh-oh. Purple guy. Iris! We can't go any closer? We cannot. That silhouette we saw. This is so Somnium. During a sink, we experience the subject's dreams from a third-person perspective. That means he must have saw or saw a silhouette of the murder and I don't know for whatever fucking reason he decided to put her in the freaking warehouse or maybe purple guy over here wouldn't put her in the freaking warehouse and he didn't know what to do uh so many questions here so many questions clear it up for me Mr. Politician in other words it has to be him I cannot say for certain but probably Oh, is it just gonna keep going over and over? Uh, What's going on? It appears that time is looping in this warped space. Time is looping? Can't you do something about that? What exactly do you propose I do? You're telling me I have to watch this scene over and over? I don't want to watch it either. Well then? I suppose we can help her. We may then be able to ask this manifestation of Iris some questions. Huh? Sure, do whatever you gotta do. Yes, we have to save Iris, no matter what! Yeah, you guys do know she's dead in reality, right? There, there, there is no saving. Yeah. But to do that, we gotta do something about that huge wooden box. Scan. Activate. Ooh, that is one big mental lock. All right, you got two. He's got three, doesn't he? Yep, he's got three mental locks. Is there a four? Oh my god, you have four mental locks. Oh jeez. Help Iris escape. If Iris escapes, you may discover so secret. Map. You can see the current location of Oz as you investigate on Zoe's map. If you're lost and want to save time, try checking the map. Okay, so we've got like... Okay, we can't go forward, so... A large wooden box. A large wooden box. I don't think we can, maybe, mm. Let's not, let's not right now. A warehouse door. A warehouse door? Listen? I 
hear a dull hear impact dull. at regular intervals, like a knife plunging into meat. Ugh. About the forklift. A forklift. Oh God. What does that mean? Roger that. Leave it to It is time to unleash the Drift King. Did My god. A minute ago. The <laughs> She's the like don't respond. respond. Um, well, you died. There's something here. Maybe you should jump in. You might unlock a bonus stage. Do you have the mind of a child? Yes. Negative timing. You picked up a timing that has negative effect. Any times can multiply time or force you to use them. If you pick one up, be careful. Um, my little well the goes through the portal. Workspace suddenly oh, jeez! Oh. No, I forgot. Yeah. My hand. Yeah, you can do it. I suppose if I must. Character like this before. Oh, she's like, oh, no box here now. Uh, Are those boxes in the way, too? We do not have time to move each one. If only we could use that crane. Large bunch made an escape path. Okay. So. Warehouse door, warehouse door, warehouse door, concrete fragments. Door, 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 door. Concrete fragments. supposed to like I could try the doors because they seem Five more useful a warehouse I hear the sound of dripping liquid occasion by liquid do you mean blood unknown but it is Okay, so that's not it. A warehouse door. Oh god, why is this one like this? Or maybe I've already used it, that's probably why. A door to the warehouse. I cannot see inside. Fuck it, go in. <laughs> you don't got time to be cautious. Every second counts, literally. Hmm? That door should have led to the warehouse, but... Um... We're here. Let's go to that other... Let's see what, what we can do with that. Is this some kind of control pin? Here. Oh, the 
this is gonna hurt. Ah! The one that is difficult for humans to input? Yeah, the GH raging combo. Fine, just be quiet. No, wait. Inputting that sequence of commands with the lever shaped like this. I think you can do it. I'll try. Oh, I did move it. Oh, it moved. Ring out. That's a KO. Even if I fail, I know what to do next time. seaweed made this way was thought to be a delicacy for nobles during the Heian era. What? Nobody needs to hear your superfluous narration. Oh, made her super small. Damn, we gotta hear you getting stabbed She's in the background. Lift it up for now. Okay, the crane is in the way, which means we have to go all the way back to the crane. Doctor, you've got less than 30 seconds. I know. I know riding won't do anything, so throw something, tackle it. Not that I am against. Can you not climb? I don't see any place to get a hold. No place to get a hold. 